Okay, here's something I think is pretty amazing. This is a wasp that I found not feeling very good uh, in my garage. So to put him out of his misery, I chopped his head off. And he is still moving around. Now, not only is he still moving around an hour and a half after I chopped his head off, but if you'll notice, he knows when something is interacting with him, he will wrap his legs around this pencil. So when I, when I go like this, boom, he knows to wrap his legs around it. And he will intermittently flap his wings. And again, no head. So I don't know how this is possible. Maybe one of you YouTubers can explain this phenomenon. Because, I mean, he is totally holding on to that. And I'm sure that his stinger is just as capable as it was when his head was still attached as well. But I just can't get off. I just can't believe. Um, he can't be in any pain because he doesn't have a head for his brain to tell him there's pain. So I just am fascinated by this. And I, I, I even squished his head to make sure that, you know, his head wasn't going to keep on living. But doggone if his body isn't still moving around like crazy.